What's going on guys, Greggles TV. I'm gonna show you how to capture a photo and or video of any Snapchats without it giving a notification to the other party that you took a photo or video of their Snapchat. So there's gonna be a couple ways. I'm gonna show you once on a Galaxy S7 Edge and another on a uh, Nexus 6P or a phone that has touch controls on the screen rather than having a physical button. So to take a screenshot, very easy. Go to a snap. Now I'm looking at her snap. So if I press and hold the home button, you see it captures it right there. And on the bottom left, you'll see a little share button. So if you press that share button, you can see it captured it. And you can do a few things here. You can text it to somebody. I tried kick, kick didn't work. You can email it to somebody. Or if you just wanna save it, you can save it to your Google Drive and have it saved there. I'll show you just how to email it. So I'll press Gmail. You choose the person that you want to snap it to and you just send it and it goes off and that way you can either share it with somebody or you can save it. If you want to capture a photo and your Android phone doesn't have a physical home button but has on-screen buttons, this is what you got to do. Go to a snap, press up and press and hold that circle button and it's going to capture the screen just like it does if you have a physical home button. And then swipe up from the bottom and you'll see that little share button. And you can see it did save it again. And from here, you can save it to Google Drive, you can text it, you can email it, very easy. Now, if you wanna capture a photo or video of a Snapchat without it notifying the other person that you did it, download this app. It's called AZ Screen Recorder and it is a free app. And what it does is it records your screen. So what you do is download it, and I will link it in the description down below, and then open it up. And then that's basically it. All you do is just hit that red button. So what I'll show you is hit this red button. And you'll see three, two, one at the bottom there. It is recording my screen at this point. Open up Snapchat and then choose your Snapchat. So it's recording all of these and it's not alerting the other person that I'm doing it. You can see right there. I'll just stop it now. Now when you're done using it, swipe down from the top and hit stop and then it gives you a notification instantly that your recording is done and you can either share it you can delete it or you can even edit it if you want or if you just want to play it you can tap right here and this is a recording of my screen I'll just fast forward it a little bit you can see right there it's recorded my it recorded all my snaps and I turned the volume off so you don't hear the volume now, if you do want to record the volume on here, what you need to do is open up AZ Screen Recorder, click this little settings button right here, and you might have to pay for this. This might be part of the paid version, which I think is like 99 cents, but this app is well worth it. And where it says record audio, you just turn that on and it will capture the audio as well. Guys, if you have any questions or comments on how to do any of this, or if you have any problems with it, let me know in the comments down below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. I put a new video out every single day at 9 a.m., so make sure you are subscribed. Thanks for watching, and I will see you guys down the road. Peace!